Rain or shine, it's never a bad day to visit one of uh, the beautiful parks in the Lakeland viewing area. In Brainerd, few changes this summer are restoring parks to even more beauty. Clayton Castle has that story tonight. With summer officially in full swing, it's time to take advantage of the beautiful parks in the area. Brainerd Parks and Recreation is making some repairs this summer to better enhance the experience, starting with the center court area at Gregory Park, thanks to a grant from Essentia Health. Really opened it up in the center court area, and in talking to some people I've seen sitting over there, they, they just say, you know, this is just so beautiful. It, it opened it up, we can see the whole park, the sun's coming in, and their next question always is, is when's the fountain going to get going? The fountain, which has been inactive for the entire spring and summer, is being restored after a few years of pipe issues. The, the Gregory Park Fountain is a, is a very historic uh, piece of the city, and uh, a couple years ago, um, the water, the pipes underneath the uh, fountain, they basically uh, rotted out. And so we were trying to figure out, how do we fix this? With the fountain on its way back, the parks in Brainerd are also seeing changes at Kiwanis Park, where the fishing dock is being repaired and added onto. During dry portions of the year, um, it, the land and the pier, uh, you couldn't, uh, you'd had to jump to get to it. Uh, during high water levels, you couldn't get to it because you had to jump up. In the end, the repairs are an effort by Mr. Saylor and his team to provide the best experience for park goers. We got some very major projects going on. The tricky part is finding the personnel and time to do it. But we're getting it all done. I got just a great staff here that they're working their tails off to, to make the parks better. Um, one of the things about a park system in any community is that's something really noticed by the public. And uh, we want to make uh, um, our park system something that people are very proud of. Now, the total cost of the three projects combined is somewhere in the ballpark between seventy and eighty thousand dollars. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. All three projects are expected to be completed later on this summer. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.